Hello, this is Coach London, here again with a scouting report for Louisiana Tech, our next opponent here at Scott Stadium. This is a team is 3-0 from the WAC Conference. They were last year's conference champions, played in a bowl game. Their offense is characterized as a spread offense. They throw the ball a lot, but they also run the ball. They're in the top 25 in passing, top 25 in running, and obviously they put a lot of points on the board. The first two games, they scored 56 points. This last game, they scored 52 points. The other part of that is, but they're giving up a lot of points as well. It's a very explosive offense. They have a couple players that really make, uh, make it go. They don't mind throwing the ball deep, but they also have a, a, a screen game, a, a, a hide screen, tunnel screen, bubble screen. They have all different kind of ways to get the ball out to the perimeter and to get it to their wide receivers. Let's take a couple uh, looks at what's going on here, and their, their style of offense and how they're playing. This first one against Rice, uh, as you notice, it's uh, kind of a pistol offense. You notice that the two of the backs in the backfield here that are blockers or pass defenders, their linemen are always up. They're never down in a three-point stance. They're always up. The quarterback does a lot of things. He calls the plays, and when he's ready to snap the ball, he signals to the center. And you'll notice a lot of times that the guard adjacent will always tap the center to also provide a, a snap count uh, and rhythm opportunity for them. Little things like that that they do, but it's something that we just need to be aware of. What you see is the play action pass of this. They try to make their passes look like runs. The rule is the offensive lineman can block down the field. And so what they try to show you is aggressive run block with the lineman blocking down the field, but at the same time, throwing the ball. So that's gonna be a challenge there a little bit, how they run block their plays with the linemen coming down the field and also our, our guys in the back end playing the pass. Here the ball is on the on the one yard line and they're coming out. A lot of teams get up in the you know, two back set and, and uh, wanna run the ball. They don't mind again, line it up in the formation, play action fake and throwing it out of the end zone. Again, watch the mechanics of the quarterback. Play action fake right here, like it's gonna be a run. And then he just pulls up and throws the ball out. One of their favorite targets is uh, number four, Quentin Patton. He's an all-conference player for them. He's a Blitnikoff Award watch list guy. He's one of the most valuable players on their team. This play occurred right after a turnover. So we talk about sudden change, about what the teams do right after a, a turnover has occurred. And this is one of those plays, kind of the flea flicker. They're running the ball like it's a play to the tailback and kind of a flea flicker back to the quarterback and he throws it deep. He turns around, flicks it back to the quarterback, quarterback under pressure, takes a hit, but he throws the ball up in the air, gets, uh, gets air underneath of it, and there number four is once again. Here's another shot. You know, like I said, they will go vertical. They put a lot of points on the board, so it's gonna be important for us to to make sure that we keep these receivers in front of us. I think we've got a good game plan for them, but this kind of shows the athleticism and uh, the ability of these guys to run. Very fast and very athletic team. Pistol formation again. You kind of see that let every, everybody spread out. We saw the play action pass off of that, but here's an actual run play. We're gonna have to tackle well. This kind of shows kind of the, the aggressiveness and the fight that these runners have. This is a good team, very good team coming to Scott Stadium. We're ready to play this game. We're anxious. We're, we're excited about getting back home, being on our home turf, and we're excited about seeing the Cavalier faithful out in the stands. So we'll see you out on game day.